happened? Good morning. Good morning, it's like midnight. We got another Flaviar box. This is the hidden gems of scotch. Oh, we got these three bad boys. Okay. Oh, so it comes with a coaster. We got the three different flavor profiles. Um, I'm not sure what order to go in, so we're just gonna dive in. Tam Navulin. Which I picked this one first because it's 40% single malt, so I thought it would be a good warm up. Are you ready? 40% is always warming. <laughs> Bring it up so that it's pretty. We got our drammies. Darwin! Darwin wants some scotch. Cheers. Ooh, did you smell it or you just gobbled it? Bitter orange. I got chocolate. Like those chocolate covered chocolate. orange things that you break open at Christmas. Oh, the orange slices yeah. of death. Ugh. Tastes like chocolate. Tastes like water at the end. Is that has bad? no taste. <laughs> Tom of Woolen. <laughs> it doesn't taste like water. <laughs> chocolatey orange Christmas treat, but then it like fades off. It's which nice. Is really it's dangerous. very smooth. I like it. What do you taste? I got a lot of chocolate. A little bit of vanilla. I can see the vanilla. Do you get it's pine really trees? Really smooth. I do not get pine trees. I think it's because the holiday. <laughs> That doesn't mean that it, everybody's, everybody's palate, what, what, what we learned when we were in Scotland, everybody's palate's different. Barley, cake, brown sugar, blackberry. Wait, for blackberry they used a cell phone instead of a blackberry. Caramel, sweet, chocolate, spicy, and lingering sweet. It's definitely lingering sweet. It's definitely got chocolate. I mean, barley, yeah, they all taste a little bit like barley because they're made from barley. Cake, I can see because it's got that vanilla -y quality. This is a I'm little not getting blackberry. I don't get any cell bear. phone in this. It's a little flat for me. I like it. It's a drinker. I give this a four. Nah, I, I'm gonna go with a six and a half, but this, this reminds me, this is like a pre-dinner scotch. Nice, it's nice, nice, it's light, it's not gonna wreck your palate. It's a good one, I like this. All right. Next on the list, Glen Skoda. Scotia. Go Scooda. Scotia. Glen Scooda. It's Scotia. a <laughs> Glen Scotia double cask, 46%. So we're getting to the what I likes. Man. I like the big percentages. I like big things. <laughs> Here, I kind of screwed you on the last one. Yeah, that's okay. They tend to screw me regularly. <laughs> Get a little seaweed. Ooh. Oh, yeah. A little pepper. It's really pretty. It's got good leg. It's got good legs. I like a scotch and a lady with good legs. I like legs. I like legs that go all the way yeah. to your ass. Um, yeah, definitely. Oh, that's better. That's better. I actually like the first one a little bit better than this it's one. It's got some like peat to it, but it's got not. a little bit. It's got a little bit smoke. of smoke. Yeah, definitely got a little bit of smoke. It's got some seaweed. I There's a spice, like pepper or something. I like my scotch when it kind of tastes like it would go with barbecue. That's kind of my sweet. It's I like, got, like smoky. The honey, sweet. I tend smoke. to avoid the seaweedy ones. No, this is like, this is like you went and got a dozen oysters and then went face first into a rack of ribs. All right. I give this a 7.8, maybe an 8. I'm going to go with a 5 on this one. Oh, really? Yeah. I like this one. Mm. You know, for this flavor profile, I'd probably just stick with Talisker. This kind of reminds me of a Talisker, only like the poor man's Talisker. How do you know it's poor man's? This like, would be more expensive Okay, so than like Talisker. maybe Talisker's dumb nephew. <laughs> this is more warm and barbecue-y to me than Talisker. Talisker is more heavy on the salt and seaweed. Malt, fudge, earthy, dry, caramel, peach, woody, sherry, and mint. I do not get any peach. Sherry, yes. Woody, I get yes. Mint. I get mint with this on like the throat, like the after effects of like I, mouthwash. I know I'm old. But in a but... good way. The last one is a spaber. 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 Wow. Asper? The... What is this? 
The last one is a Spaybird single malt. Um, it's a 15 year Highland single malt. I have a feeling we're both gonna like this. Sounds so we good. like Highland scotches, single malt, 15. A lot of people think that a young scotch isn't a good scotch, but sometimes a scotch can hit his peak young. Yeah. So this is considered young for single malt-ish. Um, this is like the rebellious teenager phase. You're not my real dad! See. Wait, what if I, wait, I like didn't do this very well. Can I rub it on your head? Oh. Hmm. It's good. Hmm. <laughs> Getting grapefruit. Oh, okay, so if you guys don't know this, Vic hates anything that tastes like grapefruit. He can eat pretty much anything but he does not like grapefruit. So if any scotch, like he doesn't like Glenfiddich because it tastes like grapefruit to him. So we could, are you gonna we be, could, we could be, you a smell grapefruit? Here. Oh, maybe a little bit. It does not taste like grapefruit. It doesn't? It just no, it tastes deceiving. like deceiving. Vanilla and caramel and cotton candy a Ooh. little bit. Look at you. Cotton candy. Cotton candy and definitely like dark chocolate. There's like a lot of dark chocolate. I'm getting this. like earwax. Cotton candy. Cotton candy made out of earwax. That's that's, that's horrifying. That's awesome. It's like Shrek. I'm getting a lot of orange. Like orange rinds, like orange oil. Some something citrusy. Mm. I can see that. Maybe that's where I got that grapefruit smell, but it's not. It's really pretty. It's not grapefruit tasting. Yeah, it's got nice legs. Mm -hmm. Spayburn. Okay. It's it doesn't. It's got an okay leg. The last one had a better leg. I'm giving this an eight. I like Ooh, this. Oh, really? Yeah, I like this. I mm. like the dark chocolate. I like a good dark chocolate. I'm giving this a six and a half. What do we got on tasting notes? Okay. Dark chocolate, yep. sweet, Is smoky. The I don't get any smoke. I don't smoke. get any smoke whatsoever. Honey, fruit. Honey, definitely. Fruit, definitely. Caramel. Yep. Apple cider. Nope. Orange peel, which I call. Orange peel. And pear. No but pear. to be fair, it's pear. all suggestion. It's not, you yeah, know, everyone's just... palate's different. You never know what you're going to taste or what you're going to like. This is the this is the fun part of Flaviar. You get to try these scotches. Some you don't know. I mean, we drink a lot of scotch and, and many of these we don't know. And then you can. Yeah. I mean, you don't, you don't have to commit to Ooh. a bottle. Pick out the ones you like. I like it. It's a good way to try stuff because like the last one we did, we liked everything. Yeah. And this one, I like. I do like this last one. I like this one. They're all different. It's this a is drinker. kind of if you. Uh, which one is this called? This is the Golden this... Gems, Hidden Gems of Scotch. If you don't like peat or oh, smoke, oh no! If you don't like peat or this smoke, is this is a great. A, this is a good box. Yeah. yeah. This is a good box for that. I like really peaty iodiny scotches, but I can appreciate still. What was your favorite? Um, probably this one because it's got that. I love dark chocolate. The spa so. Spayburn. Yeah, I thought this was going to be a horror for me, and it actually wound up being. No, it's actually actually you know what? I'm giving this one a chance. What I say, six and a half. Mm -hmm. I might bump this up to a seven and a half because it's like lingering. Early Sometimes it takes a couple sips to like coat your palate. Right, exactly and, what like, I just said. <laughs> a couple of sips. You take a couple of sips to coat my palate. <laughs> a couple of sips. The longer I drink this, the more I like it. So I'm bumping like, this up to a see, seven and a half. Like this is actually my favorite. Yeah, this one's my this favorite. This is pretty good. Oh. First one's super oily and light. The second one was um, the Glen Skoda was kind of like Scotia. Scotia booty. But we like this paper in the best. But it's cool. I would have never bought these in a store. I would have never known what they were. That I got to try them without committing to a whole bottle. So thanks, Flaviar. Cheers, babe. Oh, you drink all yours.